Subterfuge is the man in the middle framework. It makes hacking the local area network easy. There are three main parts of Subterfuge. The network attack, the proxy, and the framework. Subterfuge attacks the network by ARP poisoning it with a custom built tool that optimizes stealth while preserving the sustainability of the attack. From this man in the middle position, we can funnel all network traffic to the proxy. Subterfuge uses a heavily modified version of SSL Strip as its proxy. Through SSL Strip, Subterfuge performs an HTTPS downgrade attack to render encryption mechanisms ineffective. The framework is what gives Subterfuge the ability to do all of this at the push of a button. And furthermore, it is what allows Subterfuge to seamlessly take advantage of its attack position, harvesting credentials, integrating with Metasploit to inject exploit code and hack into victim computers, tooling in Nmap to give the attacker a better view of the network being penetrated, and much, much more. Subterfuge Beta 3.0 is our biggest release yet, and it comes with a host of new features. Chief among them is the new network attack view. We realized that more advanced attackers were limited in their capability and efficiency through our old interface. From this, the network view was born. Additional features include Nmap support, a denial of service module, and a module builder. Click on Modules and then Network View. Then click Launch in order to get started. We start up the attack like normal, but now Subterfuge will automatically identify targets and yield a representation of them. From this interface, we have an array of attack options. Clicking on Expand will give us a more defined view and additional options. Clicking on Scan will target a victim with an Nmap host identification scan, which will further update Subterfuge. From here, we can deploy the HTTP code injection module against a target with ease. Click on the injection icon, select the appropriate options, and click Apply. As you can see, we have successfully acquired a session on my Windows 7 machine running the Google Chrome browser. Subterfuge Beta 3.0 also comes with SVN-based update functionality to make keeping up to date on the project easy. To reset the attack and start over again, click Purge Data. Subterfuge now has a fully functional module builder plugin to make extending the program to suit your personal needs easy. With Subterfuge, the possibilities are endless. But here are some of the things we have in the pipeline right now. Operating system cross compatibility, a browser replay module, easy session hijacking, evil grade update exploitation, and many more settings and configuration options. Let us know if you have any suggestions or thoughts. We always appreciate them. Enjoy.